Hey guys, so today we're talking all about making the most out of your wardrobe. All right guys, so we did our first YouTube Live a few days ago and it went super well, but there was one question that kind of stood out to us that I think we had to kind of give more of an example than just explain, yeah. and it was, how do you wear you know, different suits together? So today we're gonna talk all about wearing suit separates. You asked for it, we're gonna give it to you. <laughs> Ooh, yeah. <laughs> so before we start talking about colors and, and matching and pairing it, the main thing that you need to know is that the fabrics have to be like-minded. You can't wear a wool with like a linen. You can't wear a linen with like a, you know, a wool. It has to be like a certain fabric. If not, it's gonna look totally off season and right. it won't blend in well. Basically, if you have summer suits and winter suits, mix and match those separately. Don't mix them together. Nice to say. And if you have suits that kind of work all year round, you might be able to get away, but that's kind of the gray area. Yeah, you're right. And, if you have, and also, if you have like a traditional bespoke suit that's longer, pretty much covers your seat, which is your ass, guys. You can't wear that with, with, with certain types of trousers, you know, or certain pants, like even denim. Exactly. Now today, Blake and I have both, these are both full suits separately, obviously. So Blake has this full blue suit and these full gray suit, and I have a full all red suit, which I look like Santa Claus in. I think it's more and burgundy. This navy suit that I wear quite often. But, you know, to you know turn your suits from two suits into four different looks is very simple by just you know, switching the blazers and switching the pants. Yeah, I think when I got started, I found this on on, uh, on GQ. GQ was, they had covers. I think it had like uh, somebody from Mad Men. He was wearing like, you know, burgundy pants with like a blue top. And I was like, oh shit, you know, I could do that. Mm -hmm. And then as a blogger, I had to have a new outfit every week. And I felt like I was spending all my money on just getting a new suit, new suit, new suit. So what I did was I started blending them. Yeah. And then I started blending solid colors. So it'd be a solid gray trouser with the blue, with the blue top or I would start blending a solid gray top with blue trousers. Right. From there on out, I started like experimenting using window pane trousers or checkered blazers just to mix up the variation. And you know guys, the easiest combo for us to recommend is the blue and gray combo. So blue blazer, gray pants, blue pants, gray blazer. It just so happens that the first two suits we actually recommend are also a gray suit and a blue suit. So technically if you buy these two, you have four total looks and all and if you switch up the the shirts underneath you, it's endless yeah and if you guys throw in like a vest here and there or it comes with a vest if it's a three-piece suit dude you guys are going to have at least six outfits off of just two suits exactly very easy and i mean the next thing to really think about is when you're mixing the patterns or colors or whatever try to do i guess contrasting colors at first it's going to be easier because they're actually going to pop if you get you know, two different shades of blue going on, it could look very off and very like you just mix matched your suits and not like you did it on purpose. So the key to looking like you did it on purpose is kind of what is gonna make you, make it work. Yeah, because even, even though you're wearing a gray or you're wearing a blue, sometimes the colors are just too, too rich for each other. You have to make, make sure that they're seamless. For instance, today I'm wearing, it's almost like a, they're, they're also gray trousers, they're window pane. They're very subtle though, believe it or not. They're, it's not like a loud window pane. Right. And also my jacket is like a cotton blend. So it's, you know, it's also very, there's no shine to it. So it just blends right in. If the jacket had, had like the shine, it would look like I'm trying to wear a suit blazer with just regular trousers. You go the other way as well and take your suit jackets, if they're short enough, like we said, and you know, wear them with denim or, you know, chinos or any other trousers you got that aren't necessarily part of a full suit as well. I will definitely be the first to admit that I do not do this very well. I mean, Blake does it phenomenally, and our friend Perkins, who we'll link to down below and have a few images up here, does it seamlessly. Yeah. When I tend to mix up my suits, I just tend to dress them down. So I, you know, casual them up with some sneakers or a t-shirt or a polo underneath. I don't necessarily switch the suits around very often. I don't know why I just, but it's something I don't necessarily do all the time, so. Yeah, you're right. But by you dressing down a suit, it makes you look like you have a different outfit on right. as well. Which yeah. is the goal. But, yeah. but this, this was my attempt today at suit separates, because Blake's like, when Blake said, uh, Blake said we were doing this video, I just brought this blue suit the first time, and I brought three different ways to wear it. So we're also going to do that video, which is. Three ways to wear one suit. Exactly. But I didn't realize what suit separate meant, meant at, the at the front of it. So now this is my attempt at uh, suit separates. So comment below, let me know how I did. 
if I could, you know, if I, I should work it into my wardrobe more, I'd like to know. Yeah, so basically what we want to tell you guys is that you could actually save money, keep money in your pocket by just using what you have in your wardrobe and mixing it around. Sometimes it'll work, sometimes it won't work. Just like we said, make sure that the textures and the fabrics go. Like George said, if it's a summer suit, don't wear it with a winter suit, and vice versa. If it's a winter suit, don't wear it with a summer suit. Just don't do it, don't try. Don't ever try. <laughs> I've done it, dude, and I got caught out. So that pretty much wraps up our video on Suit Separate, guys. Be sure to hit that subscribe button so you get notified next time we go do a YouTube Live, which we're taking most of our questions from these days. So, you know, tune into that. Let us know what you guys think, what you guys want to see next. Um, thanks for watching. Be sure to like us on Instagram, hashtag your pictures, hashtag Gents Lounge, and, you know, hit that subscribe button. It really helps us. Thank you. Thanks, guys. Cool. Yeah, dude. Did you check your, your pre-workout? Woo! Hey guys, so today we're talking all about suit separates. And Greenwich Village, salads and pizza. All right guys, so you asked for it, we're gonna give it to you. Uh -huh. That's why I did this, Ramsey. <laughs> Fuck yeah. <laughs> That's right. Yeah.